Hi! Today I'm going to show you how to transfer your recipes and other MasterCook files from an older computer or older version of MasterCook and into MasterCook 14. Your options depend on if you have a previous version of MasterCook installed on the same computer or not. If you have a previous version of MasterCook installed on the same computer as MasterCook 14, then the easiest thing to do is to use the Backup and Merge command from the File menu. In MasterCook 14, select Backup and Merge from the File menu. Next, close the main MasterCook 14 window. You don't want MasterCook running when we're trying to merge its files. In the Backup and Merge window, select the Merge tab. You can press the plus or minus signs to the left of the folder names to expand or collapse the folders. Remove all the check marks, then add check marks to the things that you wish to bring into MasterCook 14. I have a cookbook I want to bring over, and a menu, and a shopping list, and some ingredients that I edited in my previous version. After you have selected everything you wish to bring over into Master Convert 14, select the Merge button. If you have edited ingredients in the ingredient list in a previous version of MasterCook, it will ask you what to do about those duplicate ingredients. The existing is referring to those ingredients in version 14 which do not contain your edits. It asks you if you want to ignore the duplicate and use the existing ingredient. You do not want to ignore them because you want to replace the existing ingredients in version 14 with yours from the older version that you have edited. So, select No to All at this prompt. It will then merge your ingredients from the previous version into version 14. If you have not edited or added ingredients to the ingredient list in MasterCook, you do not need to merge the ingredient list. Once it's done, press OK and then close the Backup and Merge window. Then you can start up MasterCook 14 where you'll see that it added your content. If we click on cookbooks, we can scroll down and see that it added my cookbook. And in the shopping list, it added my general groceries. And then in the meals, it added the menu I told it to. Next, I'm going to show you how to transfer your recipes and files from a different computer using a USB drive. If your previous version of MasterCook is on an older computer, you will need to copy its files from the old computer and manually transfer them to MasterCook 14 where they belong. First, you need to locate the files from the previous version. In the previous versions of MasterCook, you will find your cookbook files, the MC2 and MCX files, within the collection folders for MasterCook. You will find the other user files, such as shopping lists, ingredient list and others inside the MC Tools folder. The location of these folders depends on the previous version of MasterCook you were using and the version of Windows you were using. If you were using MasterCook 11 in Vista or greater, you will find those folders and files within the Public Documents folder on the computer. So use Windows to open the C drive on your computer. Next, open the Users folder. Open the Public folder. Open the Public Documents folder. Open the MasterCook folder. You will find the Collection folders here and the MC Tools folder is here as well. So copy the My Collection folder and the MC Tools folder to your USB drive. So we'll select both of these folders and copy them and then go to the USB drive and paste them there. Once the files have transferred to the USB drive, you can remove it from your old computer and insert it into your new computer. 
Then you're going to want to transfer your files by opening the My Collection folder on your USB drive. Select the menu and cookbook files that you want to transfer to version 14. I want to select this cookbook file and this menu file and I want to move these to MasterCook 14. So I'm going to copy them and then I'm going to go paste them into the MasterCook 14 My Collection folder. So go to the C drive, open the Users folder, open the Public folder, open the Public Documents folder, and open the MasterCook 14 folder. And then open the My Collection folder, and this is where you paste the cookbook and menu files. Next, we're going to move the other files from the MC Tools folder that I want to transfer to version 14. So return to the USB drive and open the MC Tools folder. And in here, select the files that you want to transfer to version 14. And I just have a couple of files I want to transfer over. One is a shopping list and the other is the ingredient file. So I'll select both of these files and then I'll copy them. And now I need to go to the MasterCook 14 folder. So go to the C drive, open the Users folder, open the Public folder, open the Public Documents folder, open the MasterCook 14 folder, and then open its MC Tools folder. And then paste those files in here. Windows will ask you what to do about duplicate files. And I want to replace the ones in the version 14 folder with my files. So I'll select Replace. Now I've just transferred my files into the version 14 folders. So now start up MasterCook 14 and go to the cookbook screen and then select refresh file list from the tools menu. This causes MasterCook to inventory its folders and it'll find the files that you added while using Windows. So we can scroll down and verify that they were added. You can see the cookbook here that was added. If you have used MasterCook 9 or lower on Windows Vista or greater, you may have problems finding your recipes and cookbooks. This is because Windows Vista and Grader do not allow MasterCook 9 or less to work properly. The newer versions of Windows often move the files that contain your recipes, menus, shopping lists, and other things to a hidden location on your computer. If you contact us, we can help you with that complication. If you have any problems or further questions, feel free to contact us at MasterCook Support. Go to support.mastercook.com and submit a ticket there. We will get back to you as soon as possible.